Hello everyone, welcome back to Nigerian View. So guys, earlier this afternoon, I posted a quick update that a popular confraternity member was brought down by his rivals right there in Ikorodu, Lagos State. Now after I posted that quick update, I later find out the full information about what transpired before the young man was brought down. Although this incident happened between Black Ass and Aye, it is however said that this is not a confraternity clash. So in this video, we are going to take a look at the young man that was brought down, who brought him down, and the reason the young man was brought down. Then you can conclude by yourself what you think about this entire situation. But before I get into it, I quickly want to readdress a particular topic because a lot of Envy family members asking me to post the details of what is going on in Ojo Aziz right there in Lagos State. Now, I first want to say that this incident that happened in Ikorodu have nothing to do with what is going on between these two groups in Ojo Aziz. And secondly, the reason I haven't made a detailed video about what is going on in Ojo Aziz is because I don't have the details of what is going on. I don't want to post a video saying what I don't know and then later delete the video. But what I know is that people are being brought down almost on a daily basis from both sides of these groups that are having the clash right there in Ojo Aziz. That particular location in Lagos is very hot right now and it is a place that you won't even advise your enemy to stay if they are members of either of these two groups. Ironically, the confraternity members that live in Ojo have refused to leave and this is not about having the transport fare to travel. Even the one that have made money, they have refused to leave. The young man by the name of Lala that was brought down, he is doing well for himself. He have two cars and he is a very popular distributor of weed right there in Ojo has it. So it is not like some of these young men don't have the money to travel. It is that they are just too stubborn to travel. This is the real situation. But I don't have the full details of what is going on. So I don't want to mislead the NJ family. So I hope you bear with me about that. So with that out of the way, let's dive into today's video. Now this young man that you are currently seeing on your screen is said to have been brought down two nights ago at Ikorodu. The young man is a popular member of Black Ass and he was said to have been brought down by some young men who are members of AA. Now according to Wes on the street, it is said that this is not a confraternity war as it was explained. Now the explanation is that this young man was having an affair with a lady who is a wife to an AA member. Now, it is not just that the lady is a wife to the AA member, the lady have had a child for the AA member and the lady, the child and the AA member, they are living in the same house under the same roof and it is said that this young man was going to the house of the AA member to have an affair with the lady. Now, according to the explanation, it seems like this young man that you are currently seeing on your screen was helping out financially. Now, after the AM member have noticed that this young man was having an affair with his wife, it is said that the young man was warned to stop sleeping with a woman. But the young man had continued, according to words on the street. Now, one of the problems about this entire situation is that that particular place that the AM member lives is a territory of AM members right there in Ikorodu. I have explained this long time ago. For the people that don't understand how confraternity works in some areas in Lagos State, in Ikorodu, there is a particular location which is dominated by AM members. The territory is basically AM members' territory. There is also another territory which is dominated by members of Black Ass. So it is said that this young man was going to the territory that is dominated by AA members to have an affair with a lady who is a wife to an AA member and the lady also have a child for the AA member. So that two days ago that the young man was brought down, it is said that the young man was in the house of the AA member and that particular AA member got home that very day and caught this young man in the act with his wife. 
So he quickly raised an alarm and other AM members came, they took him outside, fired at him, boom boom boom. And before you could know what is going on, the young man already went down. So this is the reason people are saying that it is not a confraternity war because if this young man had done the same thing to his confraternity member, probably he might have meant the same faith. So this is what a lot of people are saying in the streets. So that is why I quickly post a correction on the quick update. What happened was that the young man was caught having an affair with another man's wife in the house of the man in the territory of the man. So this is the reason he was brought down. So I wasn't planning to make any video today, but I quickly decided to make this video for better understanding. And I hope that this young man will be able to come together and try to find a better way to go around this matter. Anyway, you are watching Nigerian View.